What's up guys, today we're gonna create a drain animation using dynamic paint, particle system and collision and we're gonna model on a cloud. So select the cube by the left click, click tab to go to the edit mode, click 3 to the face selection and you wanna select this face, hold shift and select the face on the opposite side right here and alt E and choose extrude along whatever it's called and just extrude those faces. Now uh, S and just move this down a little bit to create this kind of shape. Select this face above E and choose extrude. And once again S and just move this to down, yes. Now, this is my base to the cloud. Select this stupid object, go right here on this icon on the modifiers and choose subdivision surface. And we're gonna crop this to the four times, yes, four times. And choose this right here, apply. Now, Shift A, you wanna add volume empty. Select this volume empty and choose right here mesh to volume and you want to select this stupid shape and this already creates my cloud. Now I can click right here on this icon because I don't want to see this stupid cube so unselect this eye icon. This is my cloud. Click right here on the select the empty of course on the modifiers. Once again click right here on this icon you know that. <laughs> Guys uh, choose volume displays and click new of course click right here and we're gonna change this to the cloud. Uh, on this texture and I can crop the value maybe something like 0 0.7, 0 0.6 because I want to reshape this and go right here on the modifiers and you can play around on the straight too so I'm gonna maybe add value of 1 or 2 yes to have different shape to have better shape of this stupid cloud yes something like this yeah let's go this is my cloud now what next select this empty go right here on the modifier uh, on the fucking material stop uh, I don't want to record this one time on the materials click new and open the volume <laughs> and play around on the uh, volume so I'm gonna change this to the render view this is my cloud and you can play around on the density yes how much dense you want to have this stupid cloud so I'm gonna add maybe four and you can change the color to make it brighter now I'm gonna go on the solid view now what next guys shift day on the mesh add plane this plane must be inside this cloud because from this plane the rain gonna fall down to the fucking ground okay so select the plane first we're gonna adjust the material so go on the shader editor click new uh, dismiss this and you wanna add uh, right here on the shader shader uh, volume scatter plug this to the volume and you can play around on the density because you don't wanna see this plane so I'm gonna add the render view wow you don't see the plane let's go that's nice no I'm gonna go on the solid view Next, I'm gonna change this to the timeline, you see this, yes. Uh, what next? Select the plane inside, right here. Yes, if you can't select this on this view, just select right here. And click right here to add particle system, click this plus. You wanna add one particle system, open the render and change this to object. Very quickly, we're gonna add shift A on the mesh, the second sphere, open the side window and crop this to the one. And I'm gonna move this by G. Uh, y right here to this side and very quickly we're gonna model in our raindrop so click tab to go to the edit mode click one to the vertices selection and I want to select these vertices and I'm gonna just using this move tool right here we shape this yes yeah let's go now you can create better shape of course so you can select those stuff and S to basically rescale it down a little bit yeah this is the raindrop you can do better job this is just tutorial I'm gonna change this to the object mode and I'm gonna just select my plane inside go on this icon on the mode of, uh, on the particle system and on the render when I change this to object I'm gonna select this stupid object this is my raindrop those particles are gonna be falling down those stupid rains now open the velocity and crop this to the zero the particles gonna fall better yes yeah let's go this is the rain you can adjust the scale right here so make it smaller bigger I have 0 0.2 a skill roundness play around too yes yeah let's go we created this stupid shit now shift day on the mesh at plane and move this down gz right here yes uh, from the cloud right here down below and s rescale it uh, to make it bigger yes now i need to add more geometry to this because this is my water kind of plane so Click tab to go to that mode, right click and choose subdivide and I'm gonna tap the number right here, 10 and I can go right here and choose maybe subdivision surface and crop this maybe to 2 and choose apply, holy shit, uh, uh, I'm gonna rage guys, 
uh, change this to the object mode and add right here inside the surface yeah let's go now select this water ground whatever go right here on this icon and choose dynamic paint add canvas choose add canvas and changes from paint to weight and i want to select the plane inside this stupid fucking uh, cloud go on this icon and <laughs> you have the dynamic paint guys changes to brush you know that and add brush okay changes to particle system and select the particle system that you created two minutes ago okay and if i'm gonna move this let's go as you can see this have effect and this looks like shit because i must subdivide more this plane you basically want to add more geometry yes to have better smoother effect on those waves so i'm gonna do that right now so i'm gonna just go on the edit view and uh, subdivide subdivide let's go if i'm gonna just move this it's gonna be better yeah it's better the more you're gonna subdivide uh, the slower your pc gonna basically run yes so look out for that so add more geometry to have smoother effect now what next what i want to show you basically if i'm just uh, playing the animation the particles should be falling down okay from this plane it's not uh, falling down so i don't know what is going on but it should fall down so i just want to select this plane and you want to have collision and you want to choose kill particles okay this gonna basically prevents the particles falling down from this stupid plane yes down below so there is that and basically if the waves are too big you have right here the radius so we can adjust the radius of the waves yes because those raindrops are fucking small but those waves are big so we can adjust the radius yes and right here scale and you have right here you can select the plane inside the fucking cloud and you can choose use particle radius and this just gonna use the radius of the particles and as you can see this have little effect but this have some effect okay right here i hope you can see this have some effect on the stupid plane so you can you have two options yes you can select this right here and play around on the radius and you can just use the radius of the particles i hope you get it how this works guys so there is that and remember if you want to render this scene because you just created the fucking i'm just mumbling in this video guys i don't want to record this one more time because i already tried to record this uh, whatever if you want to render this always remember to right here you have the cube to set, unselect this icon yes because you don't want to see this stupid fucking mesh that we shape our cloud yes so unselect right here and right here on this icon yes you want to unselect those icons and you want to add right here some water material to your plane and you can add of course some ground material yes you can add using maybe right here very quickly on the fucking uh, add-ons you can add right here landscapes and select particular landscapes yes you have right here shift day you have the landscape you can rescale the landscapes and place this uh, you know on some landscapes or whatever you can add some ground too yes you can just subdivide the plane and add right here some displays modifier and you can have some basically water yes through the fucking ground i hope you get it this is just a concept maybe later we're gonna build some scene yes but you get it, the idea and always remember to add right here on the plane uh water material so i'm gonna select right here on ice you have the water right here yes and it's gonna look like the water have basically effect on the stupid stair shit i hope you get it thank you for watching this stupid fucking video i don't want to record this one more time subscribe if you like this content bye guys